Hello everyone, welcome to Simon Tooth. Today is the most beautiful day, good day for the ducks. I ate run at the Vietnamese uh, Viet Fort, I mean uh, Viet Fort, I mean uh, Vietnamese karaoke shop. And I come here service uh, the car, the Toyota Cougar 2010 for one of the friends working here. Uh, yeah. It's like super rainy and wet. I left everything inside the car, the car and it stopped to do the setup for the car. And this is my setup. I bought this uh, big beach iron umbrella and uh, down here the shade working really good for me in the sun, uh, in the rain. And now I start to book it and uh, actually work very well for this umbrella so I maybe get some more. So I got to do uh, full service checking oil and uh, check see the water, any leak or checking the brakes. Let's see the braking good or not. Okay, okay. Okay. The rear one. Oh man, I can see the rear one. Okay, rear still good. And uh, front, I want to see the front ones. See the front ones. Uh, the front ones. The front one not very good. Okay, we need the front brakes as well. So, front brakes need to be done. And, uh, oh man. Okay, and uh, the rear brakes are eh, gone too. Anyway, have to get all the front and rear brakes. For thumping, I do the oil change, take all the oil out, and go and buy the uh, brakes. It's uh, it's summer, but I it's summer, but I feel very cool and lovely day. So make me feel very happy. Anyway, take up the um, oil and uh, oil filter, and then we go and get the brake pads as well. We better replace four of them. It's not very good. Four modes are. V6 uh, 3.5 Orient and Cougar the oil relocate and the oil filter is always located here it's a little bit wet I lay down but anyway we are oily we are working hard we are not like uh, I already booked in for today and I did not realize that uh, it's raining today it's Monday first day of the week but anyway promise is promise okay you can uh, Say uh, you say come today and raining and you're not coming and uh, you know work out all different times so uh, different times different planning for everyone so no good I better keep my promise promise you promise okay okay here yeah. so that oil and here is location for the oil filter here yeah. and down here the car have a lot of bird nets here yeah. okay better take it up too well got all the parts here now and uh, now I lost my spot so I have to uh, turn up and go down and set up again for the uh, now the fight is windy. I hope my uh, I hope my umbrella is not fall not blow up before very windy. Anyways, uh, continue my work. Set up my uh, beautiful tools. Set up my tools and uh, we do again. Like beginning, okay. Put the umbrella in. We got. Uh, we got a beautiful umbrella, we got our oil, oil filter, air filter and two front rear pads. Now we finish these parts and then we do the brakes and then we have to pull out the jack too. Uh, lucky I got my jack today. The, um, the oil filter for the Cougar 3.5, any of them all the same. Each time you replace oil filter you have to replace the oil ring when you buy the filter it comes with the oil ring okay remember because if you don't replace it this one will leak oil trust me it will leak oil be careful i remember i serviced this car for the last three years so it was going a lot and now the brake pads is gone so in last three years before covid so it was really good and he never come see me in three years now he called me again so that means really good car see see it working and now see the new o-ring on and slide this one on and put them on so simple lights every other v6 3.5 the wind the wind blow the umbrella up me and me terrible man 
the down here, okay? Okay, I put about five, six, six, six and a half liter first before I put extra, okay? I check and put in and then air filter and done. All at the back underneath, it all secure. Yeah, we put about six liter and a half. Put our dipstick in here. <coughs> check and see where they go. So they go over like two, dot two there. We did really good, really happy with this one, okay? So nothing wrong about this. So about six and a half liter will be perfect. See the warm oil, but this oil have been serviced for three years after the COVID, before the COVID. Now I do service again and look at that, how thick the oil gets. So that's why, because they, uh, he didn't, re in three years harm, he didn't, uh, he did not uh, service. Look at that, see how thick it gets. See, that's the reason for you. So um, the dirty and dark. So that's why be careful, okay? So that's why I recommend maybe regularly, like once a year, or when you're up to the K, the kilometer, like you can go for 5,000 K or 10,000 K if you want to service. Put them all in here and clean this one and put away. And it's rainy falling, rainy falling now. Put in here and uh, we go home and clean up later. So this part is done. Okay, this part done. Go home, clean up later. And this part here, put in leverage later when we get home, over here, put in the back and uh, <coughs> put in the back of the car, that's for the dump. And that's for the car. <coughs> put in here, put in here. Later we go home, we will talk, okay? Okay. Okay, now we do the air filter and the brakes. They live in uh, three years home, if it's very dirty, if it's very dirty, that means in three years time he haven't been replaced the air filter because he haven't been taken to anywhere to service. He only calls Simon, see? Take this one up and I later clean the air filter for him too, air cleaner. So look at that, three years time, that's correct, see? Three years time, I remember I replaced for him. Now, three years time, he called me. So this, this car I will serve it before COVID, okay? Check out my jack, I'm too busy, too lazy to lift there. That's the only way to come out the car. Good, we uh, lean the car on one side. As you see, the car parked behind there. So it help. It helped me. Uh, see, stop the rain coming in. I worked out the shade here. Beautiful sum summer and for the rain today, it's worth it. Okay. So it's not. It's not bad for the front for three years home. We got about five millimeters, so more than halfway down. So we better put on both front and rear. We really good. <coughs> we need it all down. Have the um, new one and the old one. Look at that. So better put a new one on, and we are happy cow. Okay. And uh, we do one by one. We're not crawling underneath, so we don't need to put anything. Just put a check and check it up, then do one by one, and we'll be all right. And uh, very wet today, so don't want to crawl underneath and get my wet bum. Very wet bumps. The the rain has stopped for a minute, so we quickly do this one. Back to this one, one by one. So make sure clear away, and uh, if you are not feel bad, you can roll the wheel underneath for safety. But uh, you know, time is run out. Like this one, and uh, see, the three years time, the pads like this front and rear, really good. So about time to change, and uh, see, sometimes it's make noise because the, see the pad they not in properly. So I better replace it and uh, make a good one. Okay, all the, almost nearly done. Two more rear ones to go. Okay, this one. See that the new one. Okay, okay. All done, so now we can put the jack down and uh, start up the car. And um, I will say, I warranty for him start to pack up. Okay, guys, I start to pack up and go home. And I warranty him for another three years. Don't need to service again if he don't want it, or every uh, 
I guarantee for the job two years for the pet. With a way like this, three years time, it's all right. Fairly, I guarantee him for two years. And um, once a year service, if you want the two a year service, it's all up to you. Okay, for the um, for the three year time service, and make sure I put the air, make sure the air no leaking, and the engine still run fine, no trouble at all. All brake for brake pads is changed. Now about to pack up and uh, go home and uh, report to him the car was good. And I would say I guarantee him for the another two years before we do before we fix again or two years for the brakes three years for the brakes I guarantee for that and it's all good to drive and um, see beautiful so make sure to secure everything for him huh see him in another three years okay guys the car will run perfectly and now about to pack up and uh, go home with the uh, really happy and fight for another two years before call Simon again Thanks for watching Simon Tools and this is the first day of the week with big umbrella, big an umbrella and uh, still rain coming so luckily I finished the rear one without any rain coming and uh, hope to see him uh, two years or three years again do the same method again and uh, keep the car going forever guys thanks for watching Simon Tools see ya